All right, welcome to another set of lectures under market failure. Today we're going to be talking about demerit and merit goods. Now, have you ever wondered where sometimes when, let's say you're a smoker, I know some of you are out there, sometimes you always see your parents telling you not to smoke or not to take drugs, for example. Now, that is actually being a, per that's, let's say the government does it to you instead. Now, that's what you call a paternalistic government. And when a government decides something is bad for you or good for you, that's when we call that good a demerit or merit good, right? So some of you may st be starting to ask, right, how is this kind of market failure uh, or how is this kind of good different from a good that produces negative externality or positive externality? Well, the way that we approach it is slightly different in economics. Basically, uh, what we're going to do now is to set the difference, right? First thing, under negative externalities, you're looking at both the marginal social cost as well as the marginal social benefit, right? Both sides of the market. Whereas under demerit merit goods, you're basically looking at the consumer himself what the government deems is uh, necess uh, whether the whether government deems a consumer is exposed to enough information or not enough information, and secondly, um, in in externalities, you're looking at the impact of goods on society in general, right, or on third parties. Whereas under demerit merit goods, you're looking uh, you're looking at the effect of a good on the individual alone, right. But ultimately, even though we're looking at the individual alone. The effect that we want to consider, right, in order to make a proper just evaluation on, on the effect of the good on the market is on the social effect, right? And this comes under demerit merit goods, on the accumulation of, of individuals. Basically, we're saying that because it can happen to one individual, the total welfare loss of society because of the accumulation of individuals is, is much worse. And that's the, that's the difference that we take in how we approach these two uh, subtopics under market failure.